Yo, what is up, bros? Back with some Country Ball Europe 1890. We've got probably the most important campaign to take care of. Well, before this World War II one ever drops. Obviously, I'm talking about 1914. Let's go. Now, if you remember right, guys. As I grab Germany, who else would I pick? Um, When this version dropped... I tried to play with Germany and I got beat by France twice. It was embarrassing and it, I almost retired. That was almost the end of my gaming career. I was almost done. So since then, I understand this update a hell of a lot better. And I'm thinking that we can do this first. I'm going to attack every country that just has one province, trying to get them to uh, throw in some support in the way of a little puppet state. So I guess let's begin with uh, the Netherlands. Bro, Netherlands, there you are. I'm sorry, Netherlands. Somebody has to be first. It just so happens to be you. Now for this to work out, not so much with the Netherlands, but for this strategy to work out, um, we're going to need to win some rolls, especially when we attack Belgium. We're going to need that winning roll. Yeah, get shot on. Do you want to make the Netherlands a puppet state? All right, so this is the one we need to win the roll on. After Belgium, I'm going to attack the Swiss. Hold on, do they have a... Uh... They don't have an army camp. They do, however... The German soldiers are too much. Uh, it's like two, almost 2,000. I cannot afford that. We can take something like this with cheap soldiers. We can uh, fill the ranks in. Evenly matched. I need this roll. Got it. That's it. Let me crank this up to four. And uh, I think I'm going to drop some hardware on myself. I, I need to get a kill shot. 21. I can't even kill anybody. Maybe get him. Maybe. Got him. Yeah, we're, uh, if you could just focus. And I this was my bitch before. Just focus on one at a time. I would much rather you focus. They rack focus. Finish this bro off. Come on, work France ball over. He's low. Oh man, we were going to go through here with the perfect. We got robbed. Because the Netherlands ball went down. All right, that's exactly what we needed. Come on, come on, guys. Come on, you're in. But what I really want to check is the military camp. Oh, we're going to buy four of these. All right, we got four of the crappiest units uh, that money can buy. Once we finish most of this, I'll come back through and look for country balls. Nobody attacked. Amazing. That's nice. I thought I'd have to defend a bunch of places. But we're not going to have to. That's perfect. Call in my puppets. Let's go to war, guys. Check this out. Nine. Nine. <laughs> Look at all the crapper. Belgium balls we got here. We don't even care if we lose. What's the what's he gonna do with his little spade? You don't attack the bicycle brigade up there. Just slapped into oblivion. So far, and now we get th them as a puppet. Do they have they don't have a barracks either? So far, this is working out. I couldn't have pictured this working any better right now. Well, let's go ahead and take out Montenegro. 
Oh, they're going to be completely overwhelmed. Look at this. This is going to be a... This is going to be a bloodbath. I don't... We don't even need to really win the roll anymore. I mean, it's nice. But it's not needed. Not with all the Belgian slappers. You know, the Netherlands have their uh, bicycle army. But the Belgians have their slap army. Well, I guess the main one have like a, a pitchfork. We're not even going to lose anybody here. I mean, just... On the battlefield, you don't even hear gunfire or anything. You just hear slaps. Montenegro, join us, bro. Come along for the ride. Montenegro has a uh, military camp with bros with baseball bats. I'm game. See, prior to last episode and somebody, somebody commenting in it, I didn't know that you could recruit troops from your, your puppets. I had no idea. Great Britain has declared war on Norway. Everybody's afraid of me, I think. Look at the Netherlands going hard on the UK invasion launched. Well done. We'll help out our uh, bros for one. Let's go ahead and liberate the poles. I'm just going to continue to buy crapper units until the whole field is just nothing but troops with baseball bats and slapping. Look, they, they, don't, they don't even have a chance. They don't know the hack to use their, their puppet states as cheap militia. Although the slaps don't do that much damage, do they? Check out this baseball bat. Yeah. Yeah, the baseball bat does a decent amount. Freedom for the Poles. The Poles troops are pretty expensive. What the hell is that weapon? It looks like a grenade launcher. We have to buy one of those just to see what that weapon is. I'm thinking we just go ahead and go right into Milan. They're already hurting. What happened to this major army? You're not building as many troops as you once were. I mean, just... Would you rather face an army that would just shoot you and it was over? Or would you rather face an army that was going to beat you to death with baseball bats in their hands? I think the fear instilled by the army of Belgian balls that are going to beat the crap out of you until you're completely annihilated would be a little bit scarier. Ah, uh, the Russians want back their territory and France is pissed. See, I was thinking about doing that myself. We'll see how my allies... Uh, damn it, I wanted Serbia. They would have probably joined in. All right, we got our territory defended. I forgot to look at the objectives here. Annex, Republic, Great Britain, France, Russian Empire, Kingdom of Serbia, Belgium. Kingdom of Italy and Montenegro survive until the date 1918. Lest we forget what the bicycle army has been able to do. They've taken London. And actually, hold on, let's take a look at this map. They are at war with Norway. I would say let's uh let's just bring Norway into this. Come on board, bros. Come on. Join the winning team. All right, Austria-Hungary. You declared on Romania, and you're getting your asses kicked. Now, I got to come in here and bail you out. We're still saving up for that Poland Bowl. Oh, my God. They're on their own. I didn't even realize that. Oh, God. Guys, I'm sorry. This is... This is bad. Let's see him put up the A. Oh, Bucharest, and let's grab a Belgrade back. 
All right, so we got those two back. Hopefully they can beat them right here. We got enough for the Poland Bowl. And there he is looking all sexy. Grab him. All right, let's see what the Poland Bowl has. Nice. Nice roll. Damn! His Poland Bowl, where is he? Yeah, I don't know. We should be able to get the Poland Bowl. He's got 70 health too. No, we're not. There, it was a grenade launcher. Nice. Being able to buy those cheap soldiers makes this game so easy. I'm definitely going to have to move it up from normal now that I know that trick. Ottoman Empire has declared on Saudi Arabia. Norway and Denmark have become allies. We're not even going to have to go into the UK. The Netherlands and Norway are carving it up. Uh, well, I'm going to see if we can't finish off Romania. Two more of these, they might capitulate. No, we took two. They held on, so we're going to have to go at them for another round. Look at what Belgium has done to France. That is amazing. I'm going to leave the UK alone. I'm going to leave France alone, and I'm going to see if my allies can clear that shit out. Actually, you know what? I think uh, let's take out Italy first. All right, boys, we've already made it to Rome and we're going in. This is payback for betraying the German Empire. You had a 50-50 chance to pick the winning side. You picked wrong. Damn, France has been investing in some health. Kingdom of Romania is gone. My allies got it done. Look at it. Look at this. They have almost got him. Belgium is putting the hammer down on France. Though it is time for Germany to bring in the tank. Noise. The Strompanzerwagen. Look at the work my puppets are putting in. Amazing. All right, at this point, we're just trying to knock Italy out and then we'll let our allies handle France and the UK and we will go at, well, actually, Austria-Hungary is uh, already going into Russia. Austria-Hungary is no longer your ally. Well, why in the hell would you do that? I mean, we could try to get them on board. I mean, if they don't want to be, that's fine. We'll figure this out the hard way. They're back. They, they had a change of heart. So we'll finish taking out Italy and then we'll come and help uh, the Ottomans. We got them. Kingdom of Italy wants to surrender. Do you want to make them a puppet? Absolutely. Look at the UK split up between our allies, Norway and the Netherlands. And then Belgium has split France in half. We're helping the Ottomans out by uh, taking on Saudi Arabia. Going in to Riyadh. Look at the army they're going against. There's no way. Just give up. Hey, that's my character. They took a giant Arabian crap on my character. Knock him out. Not cool. Poland ball. Give him that nade. And they must have... They held up pretty well, actually, for just being four of them. Yeah, they didn't give up. We're going to have to keep going. All right, we got them. Bros helping out bros. That should help you out, Ottoman Empire. The UK's home island is completely out. Now look at them landing in France. The Bro. As the German Empire, we're lucky we got the, uh, the Netherlands out as fast as we did. I haven't even been paying attention to what Austria-Hungary is doing in Russia. Damn, they're eating up territory. I don't even, I've never even known what it's like to have allies that actually help out. We, we're not even going to have to go west. Ottomans coming back now that we helped them out. And uh, we're going to go into the Crimea. Damn, look at, uh, France has been putting some health down.
when you got this many slaps and bats, 100 health doesn't go very far. I wanted to get us one of those uh, fancy Nidalen balls to add to the greatest army Europe has ever known. France is almost gone. Now the Swiss, the badasses that they are, invading their territory in North Africa. Kingdom of Greece has declared war on Kingdom of Italy. Well, that's one of our puppets, so we can't let that stand. All right, boys, we are already going in to the Greek capital. This will be over quick. Let it be known you don't attack my puppets. Didn't even make it through the first line. The Swiss and Italy are taking care of France and North Africa and Belgium just about got them out in Europe. Kingdom of Greece is gone. All right, we're buying one of these fancy French tanks. We're also going to pick up one of those fancy British tanks. Just got enough for it. France is done in Europe and the Swiss continue the invasion in North Africa. All right, boys, we're going into Moscow. Looks like they've left. Actually, ah, damn it. I don't want to call in anybody. I want to see our tanks. They left one bro. It, they got four units out in like the Baltic states and left one guy in Moscow. We might get to see the French tank go off. Nice French tank. Nice. The Swiss just about got them. We might have to go in and help. They've actually uh, put down an army down here. We're going into St. Petersburg. No defense. We don't even need our allies. Puppets, we don't need them. We got a lone Russian soldier with a shovel. And the last of the major Russian cities, Novgorod. Let's go in there. 18 health with a shovel. Obviously, we're going to have to take a lot more territory of Russia to get them to uh, capitulate, but that's the last of the major cities. Oh, no. That was it. Nice. Um, Yeah, well, with that, we just need to clear out North Africa and uh, the, the bridge in the Middle East, and we're done. Sweden has declared war on the German Empire. They have not yet been able to break them, but they're not giving up. Uh, looks like my bros are being able to handle the UK, though. We are heading into Stockholm. They only got two bros defending their capital. This was the war you guys wanted. You declared on me. I was just happy seeing peace in Europe. And I didn't want any more deaths in Europe. I wanted a united Europe. Sweden is gone. Now, the final two obstacles. All right, well, this should be the final battle with the British. Just helping out an ally here. I mean, they do have seven units. I don't think that's going to be enough versus what we got, though. 172 health on the uh, main British ball, though. Jeez, it's a battle royale. We should be able, I think we have, uh, probably not with that defense. I was thinking we could one shot him. What's left of him anyways. Yeah, he has too much defense. Damn, they put up a battle. I'll give it up to the British. They brought it. It just wasn't enough. Only the France ball remains. And that puts an end to them. They're done. Great Britain is gone. All right, well, let's save the biggest French army for last. We'll do this one. That's a big army, and they just put another one on there. 
All right, we're going in. There it is. Look at our army and look at their puny army. They stood against all the nations. That's not going to end well for him. They might last. They might last one round against the greatest army that has ever been formed. How many rows they got left? They got two rows left. Uh, probably not. Because we'll one shot what's left on this guy. I don't think they're going to make it around. The last two. They didn't make it. There it is, bros. I'll ally with uh, the rest of the neutral countries and then I'm going to start checking all the cities for country balls. There it is. We unlock Kingdom of Serbia. An epic Kingdom of Serbia. In Riyadh, we found the Saudi Arabia ball. Which is another epic. Look who we found in Vienna. Austria Hungry Ball. Another epic. Oh shit. Look who I found in Moscow. Soviet Union Ball. Legendary. That's a nice pickup. All right, bros, that's going to be a wrap. If you are enjoying this content, you know what to do. Slap like, subscribe with the notification bell. And I'll spec your for next upload. Peace. Ruminati out.